When we talk about Dinyan of Bitochen and Hashem, it seems that the reason we talk about it is because that's the way we're going to bring out the person's feeling. Because Bitochen is a feeling, it's a mindset. And actually, feeling that the Ebishter will definitely bring him to Evanir Evanigla. So it's only, we could say, a preparation, so we should properly feel that. But the Rebbe, in the Fabrengen of Parshas Dvorim, Tovshin Lamed Dalet, the Rebbe said that the speaking, the Dibur, concerning Bitochen, is Mechazik and is massive in the Minyan Hashmire. Just the talking about it adds and strengthens the Shmire, the protection that Ebishter gives. And he gives an example. Example is, it says in Gemara that when they used to bring a korban, so in the morning, they had to bring when it got already light, so they would say that it got light, they would have to announce it, and the Loshan they would say is, that the whole side of Mizrach already is the light, till it shines to Hevron. And what was the purpose of mentioning Hevron? You should say the light is there already. So the Gemara says, in order to mention the Schus Ovis, the Ovis are buried in Hebron to mention the schus of Avram, Yitzchak, and Yankiv. And the Rebbe says, not understood. Who did the Avede? The Kayanim. The Kayanim themselves were Eindiklach, were grandchildren from the Ovis. The Levim, who did their share, were Eindiklach, were grandchildren from the Ovis. The Yisrael Bamamodim, the Yisrael Eidim, who were involved, they were grandchildren from the Ovis. So there you have the Ovis there. You have the Zecher to the Ovis there. Why do you have to say it, Heir Pnei Kol HaMizr Sheva Hebron? So the answer is that when you mention it be dibur, it adds and is mechazek, strengthens the schus of the obvious. And the Rebbe says, Bechlal, that's the whole union at Phila. Debesh, there is on him a finest Debesh, she feeds the whole world. Kuloi, betuvei. So why do we have to come on to Ayit Shabi Mispalal? Ayit should say it. And the mitzvah says of Tfila is Ayit should say the, the Tfila. The answer is that we need, the more you say it, when you say it, it strengthens the Hashpoah from Hashem. And the same thing here also, that when we speak of in the Bitochen, so the Shmire, the protection that Hashem gives you, is more. And the Rebbe even added, that according to the warmth and the excitement that you talk about Bitochen, that's how much the Shmire is. The more you talk about it and the stronger you talk about it, then it brings the Deibish that protects you more. And he brings it to Alter Rebbe Shulchan Aruch when he says that you should say Parsha Samon every day, which in Sidri doesn't say it. So in, I mentioned it before, so Madure Tinyone, the Alter Rebbe says that this is in order to awaken the Bitochen. And that's the reason why we should say it. And it's interesting, the Rebbe brings what it says in the Sefer Eir HaMeir. One of the Talmidim of the Mezritcha Magid and Tzemach Sedeh brings him in my Morim, etc., etc. So, the Eir Meir explains that by the month, the Gemara says there were three categories. Tzadikim, Beninim, and Rishoyim. Because it says in Posik that the month fell next to your house. It says the month fell further away, and then the month self went even further. So, the Eir Meir says that this, and the Gemara says this is a dry cat, the, the three categories of Yidin. Tzadikim, it fell right next to their house. And by the Beninim, it fell further. And by the Rishoyim, it fell even further. And even... How they did it, if it felt like a finished product or it felt that you still have to uh, uh, bake it and, or if you still have to grind it, also depends if you're a, shoy, a, a, a tzaddik, a tzaddik felt finished product, by a bainini you still had to bake it and by a rosha you still even had to grind it. So he says, what does that mean? That these three levels depend on the levels of bitochen. The ones that had the real, real bitochen and it seems from here from the Sikha that spoke about the bitochen, so by him, it was all the way. It came mama straight in front of his house and it came finished product. The one that were banging him in Bitochen and talking about Bitochen, it was not like that. And the one that talk, didn't speak much about Bitochen, so by them, that was the worst thing. So here we see that number one, the Bitochen itself brings that the Ebesh should do the Shmir and give you what you need. And not only that, but the talking about it is also, besides the fact that when you talk about it, it is ma'ayr a person to think about it and it brings it into a feeling, but the talking itself helps that the Abish should protect us. And that's why we keep on talking about Dinya Nobitochan.